Hi everyone and welcome to Research and Analysis. In this video, I am going to discuss how to collaborate in presentation in PowerPoint. So this option allows you not only to share the copies of your slides rather than the people who you just select, they can view and also edit that file. So this will help you to collaborate in a presentation with your other colleagues. So rather than creating multiple files and in the end, you will definitely will be worried about the changes that are being incorporated in the multiple files and then you have to compile all those changes and to create a new one. So it requires a lot of efforts and time. So rather than that, you what you can do is use this option and all your colleagues can work simultaneously on the same file and in the end you do not need to be worried about the changes or the editing that are being made by your colleagues so how to use this option first of all just go to the share and in share option just click the share button so it will be saved in your OneDrive. So in the first step, you need to go through this option of share. And then you will click this share option. Once you click this share option, it will ask you which OneDrive account where you want to save this file. Since I have already selected the OneDrive account, so it's not showing that option here. But if you are doing it first time, then definitely it will ask you where you want to save your file. After uh, saving to the OneDrive, you can share the link to your colleagues. Here you can enter the email address of the people whom you want to share the slides. So after adding the email addresses of your colleagues, you can just simply select send and this link will be shared with your colleagues and along with that you can also write the details about the presentation if you want to highlight some point then you can write the message as well this option is very useful especially when you are collaborating with your colleagues on a specific presentation and it will make your work a lot easier than if you are just sending the whole presentation through the email so i hope this video will helpful thanks for watching